HCL is what gives the knee stability when you bend it. Various studies have shown that women have a five to 10 times higher rate of ACL tears than men. Why is this? Some research suggests it's biomechanical. Women have a higher pelvis and women jump and land differently to men. Other studies suggest the menstrual cycle may be to blame with days nine to 14 of the cycle shown to increase the likelihood of an ACL tear. ACL tears are generally quite serious and often require surgery. What we do know definitively, and this is the way female AFL teams are now starting to train, is that squatting, lunges and high knee shuttle warm-ups will really help prevent tears. Symptoms of an ACL tear include a popping sound on the injury, severe pain and swelling, a feeling of instability and a loss of range of motion. Activities linked to ACL tears include suddenly slowing down or changing direction, landing and jumping incorrectly, and pivoting with your foot firmly planted on the ground. A direct blow to the knee can also cause an ACL tear. Treatment includes stopping the activity, seeing a doctor, resting a limb, icing it up, and putting on a compression wrap with elevation. Physiotherapy may include a brace and crutches, and surgery is often necessary if you want to continue to play pivoting, twisting sports like netball. ACL tears, unfortunately, will generally not heal on their own.